Today I have Linda with me, and Linda's going to share about her nursing career and her journey here at Wayne. So Linda, how many years have you been a nurse? Uh, since 1989. And what was your inspiration for becoming a nurse? Um, I think when I remember back, um, I was nine years old and my grandmother was in the hospital and I had to wait in the waiting room, but I could see the nurses going, coming and going, coming and going. And I think ever since then, I always wanted to be a nurse. Of all the years, because you've seen a lot of things as a house super and, and working as a, as a nurse on the floors, what has been your most inspiring patient moment? I think many years ago I had a patient that um, the doctors, uh, he had been on a ventilator and they had did many tests and deemed that the patient was not going to survive and they was going to withdraw treatment. And I had taken care of him for several days and was there on the day that the treatment was withdrawn. And after the family sat with him for a while once he passed, um, they came up to me and thanked me for taking care of him. You know, even though they had that great loss, they still had that moment to come and say thanks. And I think ever since then it was knowing that I am doing something good. If you were to share any words of wisdom with nurses that are maybe young coming into the profession or looking to change careers and become a nurse, what words would you share with them? I think uh, for new nurses, someone that's just thinking about going to school, you know, make sure you're doing it too um, because you care and you want to you want to make somebody's life maybe a little bit better. And then once you become a nurse, don't stop asking questions. It's an ongoing learning. In nursing, you never stop learning. So don't be afraid to ask questions and don't be afraid to rely on the nurses that's been here for a while. Well, thank you again, Linda. Thank you for your years of service, your dedication, and your commitment. Thank you.